You go, Jack. Hey, more news for the return of hockey. Coming up at 5, when NHL training camps might begin. It's 4.54. Visit your Greater Houston Honda dealer today for great deals on a great selection. Mattresses for Less has purchased premium inventories from Bankrupt Mattress One, Tempur-Pedic mattresses, Stearns and Foster mattresses, all marked with deep discounts. Always wanted a Tempur-Pedic but couldn't afford it? Now you can. Number one in service with same-day delivery. Mattressesforless.com. The new house is amazing. So much character. Original crown molding, walk-in closets. We do have a wrap problem. At least GEICO makes bundling our home and car insurance easy. It does help us save. For bundling made easy, go to GEICO.com. We hear it every day. All the things we should do to help ourselves, protect ourselves, and keep our family and community safe. But there's one thing we can all do together that is as easy as it is important. Complete the 2020 Census. Just take a few minutes online by phone or by mail, and your participation could help inform how billions in funding will go to health care, education, and emergency services each year for the next 10 years. Shape your future. Start here at 2020census.gov. This city, with the biggest heart the good Lord ever created, is facing a viral tsunami or St. Luke's Health. And right now, our city's healthcare teams, EMS, police, and firefighters are on the front line. So what can we do to help them? This, wash our hands, social distance, stay home, and if we have symptoms, call the doctor. Let's all show what our big Houston heart really can do. Landmark Furniture's Spring Sale. Get living room sets starting at $3.99. Bedroom sets starting at $4.99. With instant approval regardless of credit history. Plus free financing, 100-day price guarantee, and free same-day delivery. LandmarkFurniture.com. All right, we're back here at 456. A perfectly preserved ancient Roman mosaic floor discovered in northern Italy. Yeah, archaeologists made this stunning discovery almost a century after an ancient villa was found on the site. You can see pictures of the floor posted by the government. Oh, government show, oh, wow, that looks like something that people are doing today. Wow, that's <laughs> awesome. They show these intricate patterns and colorful details. All this was buried underneath a vineyard in the township of Negrar, that's north of Verona. See, that's why I like to keep my truck muddy, because it's a protective coating over the finish. Yeah, right. Same situation, Eric. One great. way to look Same at situation. it. No, you, great minds think alike. <laughs> I don't think I've washed my car in months. <laughs> Just for that reason, it yeah. keeps it looking beautiful on the underside. Underneath, right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, you may want to wash your car, though, today because you know what? Most of us are going to be rain-free if you coastal showers. But look at this, the stretch of dry air. Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Yeah, you get your car clean today. It's going to stay clean for a right. while. Temperatures, though, getting into the 90s is going to be warm. All right, we are following a breaking news, news alert out of Fort Bend County. That is where a deputy constable has been accidentally shot by a sheriff's deputy. Coming up, we're waiting for a press conference with the Harris County Sheriff that could start in just a few minutes. Don't let hurricane season catch you off guard. Download KPRC2's hurricane tracking chart and tune into our hurricane and flood survival guide Wednesday at 7. You'll find all the answers to help keep you and your family safe. Like the best supplies to keep on hand. The do's and don'ts during a storm or flood. And how COVID-19 and social distancing could affect evacuations. KPRC Channel 2, your go-to weather team. Wednesday at 7, brought to you by Generator Industries. This is an ad for a new diaper brand called All Good. An ad for diapers that make a difference. Diapers that pay it forward when you purchase. When you buy a box, we donate a day's worth. That's the difference. Diapers with all of the good. Leakage protection, softness, bold prints, and none of the bad. No latex, no parabens, no fragrances. All good. Diapers that make a difference. Only at Walmart. 
am finally opening Supernova's brand new and largest showroom in Katy, Texas. Visit our Northwest, Southwest, Central, and South Houston stores, and especially our newest showroom in Katy to take advantage of our 40, 50, and even 60% discount of all our regular prices today. Or fill your entire home with Supernova famous package deal where you buy a master bedroom set and you get a living, dining, and second bedroom for the kids or a guest room and absolutely no additional cost. Welcome, your DSW store is open. You love shoes and we do too. You won't find brands this amazing anywhere else. And we've dropped our prices. Whoa, sandals under $20. The lowest prices you've ever seen. And while you're getting all those crazy good deals, we'll be keeping you extra safe with designated try-on areas and social distancing measures. Looking for the best shoe store ever? The hunt is over. Channel 2 News begins right now with breaking news. Uh, yes, indeed, from Fort Bend County this morning, a deputy constable shot in the chest by a brother in blue. That person was rushed to the hospital to Memorial Herman. We'll go live to the neighborhood Sienna Plantation with what we know so far. Also breaking in southwest Houston, a violent chase ends after police say one of their own shot an armed young man. How he and the officer are doing and what police chief Art Acevedo is saying about this incident. Also breaking news from Minneapolis, a police precinct overrun by protesters and set on fire. National Guard members are heading to there now. Uh, we're following the other chaotic protests going on around the country after the death of George Floyd. Good morning. It is Friday, May 29th. We're going to get to Eric and Anavid on the weather and traffic in just a moment. First, we want to get to that breaking news out of Fort Bend County. We are told that a deputy constable was accidentally shot by a sheriff's deputy in blue. Both were on the job. So the investigation is underway at Chestnut Bend and Acorn Bridge. Our Vincent Crivelli uh, is live on the scene there, and I know we're waiting for a news conference as well here shortly. Vincent, what's the story? Oh, and that's right. Looks like Troy, Sheriff Troy Nails is on his way over here, but let me give you guys some details real quick. We know the deputies were investigating a call together at a home behind me. Authorities say a Fort Bend County Sheriff deputy and a Precinct 4 Constable deputy responded here around 2 o'clock this morning. And at some point during the investigation, authorities say the Sheriff's deputy accidentally shot the deputy constable in his upper left chest area. The injured deputy was transported to the hospital via life flight. A very tough situation for law enforcement this morning. You can see several investigators are on scene trying to figure out what exactly happened and what went wrong. Again, not a lot of details right now, but we are expecting an update from the sheriff in just a few minutes. For now, reporting live in Fort Bend County, Vincent Crivelli, KPRC, Channel 2 News. All right, Vincent, we'll come right back out to you as soon as the sheriff is ready to speak. We know the deputy constable was immediately rushed to Memorial Herman Hospital. Our uh, Kathy Hernandez is there in the med center this morning. Uh, what are you seeing, Kathy? Well, there is some officers here. We have Fort Bend County Sheriff's Office patrol car. We also have Fort Bend County a Constable patrol car as well. Several of them have arrived just in the last 30 to 45 minutes. Of course, we're all waiting here to see exactly what is going on. But as you guys have said, they flew him here to Memorial Herman Hospital in the medical center. They do tell us Constable Trevor Nails is here at the hospital, but we have not seen him and he is not given us an update. Of course, we're waiting for Sheriff Nels to give us an update there at the scene, and we'll continue to follow this developing story. Putting in live in the medical center, Kathy Hernandez, KPRC, Channel 2 News. All right, thank you, Kathy. We will continue to monitor this investigation throughout the morning. 